Next, I'm going to discuss about the try and method of this program. So if you debug the code control comes to main function here after that coincide. So right here, I've taken integer uh, variable a double r. So this is array tab. And right here, I've given size so 25. So you can enter maximum 25 elements in the array. So this is a double r. size 25 or uh, next variable n1 n and n1 so here after next variable is i and flag Flag initialized to zero. Here after control comes to see out. So whatever I in double code so that or display into the output screen, enter any number, and whatever I'm going to enter, so that received by n. So I'm going to give n value six. And here after see out. So whatever I in double code, so that display into the output screen, enter array elements, and here after four, I value start from zero. Check the condition 0 less than 6 condition is true. So 8 over 1 is 0 position. Let's enter number. So this is 0. This is 1. 2. 3. 4. Five. So it will have a zero position. Let's enter number. So I'm going to enter eleven. And here after I gonna increase by one. So I become zero to one. Check the condition one less than six. Condition is true. So let's enter eight of out of one position. Some elements. So I'm going to enter five. Here after I gonna increase. So I is two now. Check the condition two less than six. Condition is true. So it will order two poison saying let's enter number so I'm going to give six are you gonna increase by one so I is three now check the condition three less than six condition is true so let's enter eight of our three poison some element so I'm going to enter seven here after I gonna increase by one so I is three to four check the condition for less than six condition is true so it will order four poison let's enter the number so I'm going to give 9. Here after I gonna increase by 1. So I is 5 now. So check the condition 5 less than 6 condition is true. So let's enter 8 over out of 5 position element. So I'm going to give 5. Here after I gonna increase, so I become 6 now. Check the condition 6 less than 6 condition is not true. So that not coincide. Control comes to this point. Here after control comes to this point, see out. So that's it. then cursor bring to the new line and uh, this will display into the output screen into the elements to search so whatever i'm going to enter so that go to n1 so i'm going to give uh, 6 to n1 so here i will start from 0 check the condition 0 less than 6 condition is true come inside here a double out of 0 position double equal to n1 so 0 position is 11 n1 is 6 0 double 11 double equal to 6 condition is not true so that not go inside so here after that go up and increase the value of i i is now 1 check the condition 1 less than 6 condition is true so that go inside so it will out of 1 position double equal to 6 1 position is 5 6 uh, and n1 value is 6 so 5 double equal to 6 condition is not true so that go up and increase the value of i so i is 2 now check the condition 2 less than uh, 6 condition is true so that coincide 8 over out of 2 position double equal to n1 so 2 position is 6 6 n1 value is 6 6 equal to 6 condition is true so flag become 1 now here after see out so this are displayed into the output screen number n1 n1 value is 6 found at the position i plus 1 so i value is now 2 2 plus 1 so this our display 3
So number six pond at position three. Here after cursor being to the new line. Now control comes to break statement. So since break statement comes, so that terminate the loop. So here after control comes to this point. If flag value equal to zero, flag value is now one. So that not go inside. Here after that outro main function. Then the output comes number six pond at position three. So suppose here or uh, this position is five is the and five. Suppose if I enter annual value five. So here the same process continue on annual receive or uh, five. Here after i value start from zero. Or check the condition zero less than six condition is true. So eight over our zero position double equal to n one. So eight over zero position eleven n one value five. Sorry, n one value five. So eleven double equal to five condition is or uh, not true that not going side i go nine case by one. So i is true now. Check the condition two less than or uh, six condition is true. So eight over two position equal to n one. So two position is five. N one value I enter five five equal to five condition is two flag again become one so at here this or display number N one value five point at position I plus one so one plus one two so number a five point at position two here after break a statement comes so that outflow loop and here after that outflow main function so at here five is so uh, two position for Five is index is uh, first index is uh, at one and uh, second five index is five. So this is uh, two position and this is a six position. So I wanna display this on. So for this uh, need to mark as a comment or break a statement. So at here. I value is now one, so that found here after break a statement. I mark so its compiler could not find break. So here after that increase the value of i. So i become two now. Check the condition two less than or six condition is true. So eight over our two position double equal to n one. So two position is six six double equal to five condition is not true. Not going inside. I gonna increase by one. So i is three now. Check the condition three less than six condition is true. So that go inside eight over our three position equal to N one, so three position is uh, seven seven double equal to five. Condition is not true. Again, that increase the value of i. So i is four now. Check the condition four less than six. Condition is true. So that go inside. So eight over our four position double equal to n one. So four position is nine. N one value five. Nine double equal to five. Condition is not true. So that not go inside. Again, that increase the value of i. So i become five. Check the condition five less than six. Condition is true. So eight over our five position double equal to n one. So five position is five and n one value five. So both condition is not true. Flag is now one. Add here. Oh, uh, this on display output scale number n one value five. Point at position i plus one. So five plus one or six. Number five point at position six. Here after. That go up and increase the value of i. So i becomes six. Or uh, check the condition six less than six. Condition is true. The condition is not true. That not go inside. Here after, if flag double equal to zero, so flag value is not zero. So that not go inside. Here after, that out for main function. Suppose if I enter n one value. Or not in the array elements, so I'm going to enter 12. So at here that check one by one. So first time check 11 double equal to two, five double equal to 12, six double equal to 12, seven double equal to 12, nine double equal to 12, and five double equal to 12. The condition is not matched, so that that not go inside. So at here flag value become zero only. So check the condition flag double equal to zero. Condition is true, so that comes there. So at here number not found in the array and value of n one. So n one value twelve. That is true.
hereafter mean order for mean function. So this is the drive and method of this program. So I hope guys this video is helpful for you. So thanks for watching. See you next week.